My name is Kevin Hines. I'm married to this lady, Margaret Hines, and uh, we're, we're in all senses of the word a team. We work together all day, every day, uh, for the cause of suicide prevention, a social movement, a social justice movement, uh, taking a global turn in helping people from all over the world uh, stay hopeful, because when you lose hope, you you suicide becomes an option. Stay hopeful, uh, stay true to themselves, and stay alive. Because I've been there. Because in the year 2000, I attempted to take my life. It's the worst day of my entire existence. And I attempted in a way that is 99% fatal. And I get to be here every day, where 16 years ago I should have died. When you, when you almost die in such a tragic and horrific way, um, you see life differently. And so my goal is to just try and help as many people as we can. And doing this as a team, it's the best. Because whenever I'm down and in a lot of pain, She's right there and got my back and props me back up. Because I love this man. And um, when I love, I love really hard. And I don't know how to not be supportive of somebody that I love. Um, Kevin lives with chronic suicidality and that impacts my life. And so it's really important to me um, to to help other people um, who have gone through it um, find hope. Uh, men uh, are quite typically uh, afraid to talk about their brain health, their, um, their feminine side, uh, their, uh, the fact that everyone cries and they don't want to. They don't want to show fear or, or weakness. It's not weak to talk about your pain. It's a strength. It allows you to be a better man, a better person, a better husband, a better father. When you recognize that you are vulnerable and are sharing that vulnerability with those you love who comprehend, understand, and empathize, you're doing yourself and everyone around you a great service 